Hey everyone, welcome to another video of my channel. Usually I upload tutorial videos but this is the first time when I'm going to upload an unboxing review video uh, of this Cosmic by Demos RGB gaming USB plug and play microphone. Uh, so this isn't a paid promotion, it's just an honest feedback unboxing video from my side. Uh, I purchased this mic for a specific reason because as of now the voiceover audio for my videos I used to record it using uh, my Android smartphone and the quality wasn't up to the mark. I wasn't satisfied with the quality of the audio which I used to get post recording and I also used to edit that audio using Adobe Audition and Premiere Pro post recording but uh, the quality it wasn't up to the mark and I wasn't satisfied with it. So I decided to upgrade the way in which I record audio for my videos. Uh, so I decided to purchase this mic and I also thought that let's make a video on this one. This microphone costed me around 2,599 rupees which is equivalent to 31 US dollars. And this brand Cosmic Byte, it's a very popular brand in India. Those who are watching this video from India, you might be familiar with the brand. But I don't know whether Cosmic Byte uh, is available outside India or not. So I'd be providing a link of this product down in the description. You can check it out yourself. And uh, now let's start with the unboxing. So now you can see over here that I have connected my microphone with the laptop using the USB cable and once the microphone gets switched on it looks something like this. The colors, the RGB colors of the microphone are pretty cool and it looks very good. And uh, there is no need to download any drivers in order to use this microphone, it's just simply plug and play. So that's a very uh, easy feature you can say about this microphone. And over here in this section, you can see that there is a total of two buttons and two knobs below. The first one is for the LED, the second one is for mute. The third one is to control the gain of the audio that you are recording. And the last one is to control the volume of the audio playback that, that you are hearing uh, while you are recording. And you can hear your audio playback by connecting a headphone down below over here using this jack so in order to control or change the rgb colors you can use this first button you press it once the color changes and if you don't like the color you can also switch it off like this there are a total of 
five or four colors i guess and the colors look pretty good and then there is the second button which is the mute button you can use it to you know mute instantly just like this by pressing it once and once the mic is muted the red color rgb will come on the top and this led indicator over here it will also turn red press it again to switch off the mute mode then there is this knob you can use it to change the gain of the audio that you are recording increase or decrease it and the last one as i told you you can use it to change that is increase or decrease the volume of the audio playback that you are hearing once you are done recording or while you are recording it so that's it but now i would like to tell you about this cool hidden feature so you might be wondering about the noise cancellation what does this mic has when it comes to noise cancellation so there is no separate button for noise cancellation but if you long press this mute button then the noise cancellation gets switched on and this led button over here it will have this blue light in it that means the noise cancellation is currently switched on and if you want to switch it off you can long press this mute button and once this light goes off from the led button then that means that the noise cancellation feature of this mic is switched off so that's a cool hidden feature i don't know why they did it like this they could have added a separate button for the noise cancellation feature just to make it a little bit easy to understand but this is how you activate the noise cancellation feature in this microphone by long pressing the mute button another interesting feature of this microphone is this touchpad located on the top you can use this one to mute and unmute as well as switch the noise cancellation feature on and off all you have to do is just tap it once and it gets the job done however i noticed that this touchpad area of my microphone it isn't very touch sensitive and sometimes it doesn't work properly so maybe this is a defect in my piece but i don't know whether it's a genuine issue with this product or not but apart from this the rest of the buttons and everything it works perfectly fine now let's move on to the part where we listen to the audio that's being recorded by this microphone so the audio that you are hearing right now is being recorded using this microphone there is a ceiling fan running in the background i have done that on purpose because i wanted to generate some amount of background noise I have kept the gain of this microphone on medium and I have switched off the noise cancellation feature of this microphone. So this is how it sounds in the normal mode and I must say that this quality is quite decent. There is some amount of background noise but it's justified because I have switched off the noise cancellation feature. So now let's switch on the noise cancellation feature and see whether there is any difference or not. So now that I have switched on the noise cancellation feature I hope you can hear the difference in the audio there is a significant amount of decrease in background noise this time and I must say that this noise cancellation feature works perfectly fine in this microphone this is a cardioid microphone so this captures the sound waves that are coming from the front and it won't capture the sound waves that are coming from the side or from the back so usually you shouldn't have uh, much of a problem regarding noise or background noise in general with these kind of microphone but if you are recording from a room where there is a lot of noise then you can definitely use this feature and noise cancellation in this microphone works perfectly fine overall i can say that the audio quality of this microphone is decent it's good and at this price point you can definitely consider this one and if you are looking for a microphone between 2000 and 3000 rupees then you can definitely go for this one that's all from my side in this video and i hope you find this video useful if you do so then be sure to drop a like uh thanks for watching see you guys in another video